see you take hours to greater and greater heights. I only request, don't forget your mica. CNBC TV 18. Thank you so much, Lata. You know, and uh, thanks for your wishes. And of course, uh, CNBC TV 18, uh, always my first love. So, yeah. <laughs> thanks a lot. Okay, I think you should get back to work over there. The team is waiting for you. And we have our technical experts joining us, Sudarshan Sukhani and Mitesh Takkar. Uh, good morning to both of you and a fabulous 2023 to both of you. Uh, Sudarshan, may I start with you? How are the indexes positioned? Uh, good morning, Lata, and a very happy new year to you, your family, everyone. See, the indexes are not positioned well. They are in a choppy and sideways environment. And once the markets become choppy, essentially it means they are not exhibiting a trend. That becomes a difficult problem for traders. So for me, there is no clear trend in the market, neither up and nor down. It's really sideways. Sideways markets are difficult to trade. So my view for the day for the Nifty is, I expect choppy market conditions up and down, and the Nifty is probably going to be an easier trade on the short side. But the bank Nifty is the exact opposite. We can expect choppy market conditions in the bank Nifty also, but I do not think the banks should be taken on the short side at all. If you find a dip, if you find some intraday movement on your charts, take a long side on the bank Nifty. So both the indices are giving different messages. Okay, that's interesting. Sudarshan, Mitesh, Happy New Year to both of you. Hope you have a year filled with great health. That's all I wish for people these days because nothing else really matters. Yes. Uh, Mitesh, good morning to you. What's the outlook on the index uh, for the morning and slightly medium term as well? <clears throat> good morning, Sonia. Wishing you, uh, uh, the team of CNBC and the entire viewers a very, very happy new year. Thank you for your wishes as well. Uh, on the index, uh, my overall view is slightly on the negative side, and I've been suggesting that uh, rallies close to about 18 to 50 should be used to create positional shorts. But in the short term, uh, I think there is uh, clear cut choppiness. The market direction, uh, market direction is not very clear, and I think the uh, indices are, uh, uh, you know, giving conflicting signal. Barring the bank Nifty, where which is where we would explore some long positions as well on the stock sides. But otherwise, on the Nifty. I think till 18,250 is cleared, we can safely assume that the uh, uh, the medium term view remains on the negative side. And if we start breaking below 18,750 zone, then I think I'll start shorting as well because then that will indicate at least a test of 17,800, which was the recent low, maybe uh, a test of levels below that. Okay. And with that, uh, let's come over to the stocks. Sudarshan, what stocks today? Well, it's mainly on the long side because individual stocks can still give us a better performance. Uh, granules is my only short side uh, stock. Granules has been in a bear market. Uh, relative strength is poor. Momentum is going down. Intraday shorts are justified with a stop above 325. Tata Powers is a buy. The stock had a nice V-shaped rally in the last two, three days. And the trend is now turning to up. Buy Tata Power with a stop under 205. REC Limited has been an outperformer. I think we have a lot of reasons why, it's so you'll probably know much better. But it's making new highs for this period, even as the Nifty was languishing. That's a buying opportunity. It's a positional buy also if you want to carry it for a few days. Stop under 106. And Can Bank is a buy. As I explained to you for the banks, the banks are not a shorting candidate. They are intraday buys only. Can Bank could be an intraday as well as a swing trading buy. Stop under 321. And that applies to many other PSU banks. Look only to buy them. Okay, all right. Uh, Sudarshan, thanks for that. Uh, let's go across to Mitesh. Morning, Mitesh. Happy New Year to you. What are the picks you have for us today? Morning, Nadir. Wishing you a very happy New Year as well. Uh, on the stock side, Can Bank is something which I have in common with Sudarshan. That's a buy for me for a, with, with a stop at 328 for a target of 345. And the other one uh, on the buy side is National Aluminium. Here, I would recommend taking long positions with a stock below 79 for targets of around 85. <clears throat> I have two FMCG names on the sell side. Uh, the first one is Britannia, which I would recommend selling with a stop at 43.35 for targets of around 42.30 on the downside. And Marico as well is a uh, sell side trade. Keep a stop at 515. Look for mild declines to about levels of 495. All right, let's do one thing. Let's take a quick break. On the other side of the break, we'll have the pre-opening rates kicking in. We'll also have Krishna Nayasvi of HDFC Securities to discuss outlook 